Welcome to Girl Talk. We are filming at the fabulous Pink Poodle. And we, yeah, we're gonna be talking about uh, organizing your closets and out with the old and with the new. Kind of yeah. feels appropriate. It, I mean, at 20 degrees, I'm like, it's springtime. I know. sunshine. You're 20 with the color. color. I need to get some color back in my wardrobe, <laughs> obviously. Black's always good though. It's kind of your <laughs> staple. Yeah. Talk about it, yeah. Well, you need a little this slimming sometimes, right? <laughs> Especially now. Especially no, we are baby bump is so cute. <laughs> but uh, no, that'll be good. Get those Christmas sweaters out of the closet. Get some new things in. Yeah, it's time. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Looking ahead to spring. I had 20 degrees, 30 degrees even a, a, mm -hmm. a few days here. 30 degrees is like the new 80. It's right. <laughs> so sad that you get used to. I isn't know. It? Your normal just shifts. Right. And it's just too bad that we're happy about 30 degrees, <laughs> but yep. hey, we'll but take it. Isn't mm -hmm. January flying by though? Like it's That's, almost yeah. Valentine's Day. Yep, right. And real real estate's insane right now. So is if it really? you are, oh my gosh, I'm so busy. I've got a ton of listings coming up, which is so good because we need them. If you're thinking of buying, <laughs> buying or selling, especially selling, uh, check out what your home value is worth. Is this a good time of year to do that? Yeah, well, if you beat the spring rush, I mean, there's sure. less, I mean, buyers are here now looking. I mean, they've had, December was busy even. Wow. So buyers are frustrated at the lack of inventory. Mm -hmm. So if you're one of those what a sellers, flip. yeah, I mean, if you're out there thinking, oh, I might list in the spring, you need to do it now because once they have more options, you know, it's supply and demand. Sure, sure. Get So in there. beat the rush for yeah. sure. Out with the old and with the new. Yeah, absolutely. It is, it's hopping. But I thought maybe that's why January has been flying by for me because I've been so busy with that. But yeah. I don't know, everyone, I'm, you know, we're talking about Valentine's Day. We're like, whoa. I know, <laughs> right? I still have my Christmas tree up and it's Valentine's yeah. Day. I'm gonna have to put new decorations on hearts or something. Yeah. <laughs> I always keep mine up till my birthday, which is early February. Girl just because loud. it's so beautiful. Yeah, yeah. that's well, your and holiday it just perks switch. Up. Yeah, and like, like we were saying earlier, just you can get away with it in Wisconsin. Because mm -hmm. it's still cold, there's snow on the ground, it's still so dark and Why not? dismal, right? Sure. If you, you wait too something. long though, then the city doesn't pick it up. Oh, I have a fake tree. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> so that's okay then. But I might be in trouble because yeah. I got a real trip. One time I, I, I came home, well last last year, this time I was in an accident in Mexico. So I was had eight days in a hospital down there and thank God everything turned out okay. But when I got back, you know, delayed and I totally missed the city pickup of the trees. And I'm like, what am I going to do with it now? <laughs> so I stuck it in my garbage can. Did <laughs> they take it? Yeah. Oh. I have a really big tree. I need a bigger can. <laughs> I don't know. Like I don't, I don't encourage that. Well, maybe I'll get letters from the city now, but yeah. now you it will. It works sure. once. I don't know. Right. Don't don't do as she says. <laughs> maybe put it on the curb and it see what It was a medical you can emergency. Out. There we go. Okay, <laughs> we've justified it. I like it. Um, well, I'm excited to talk about the upcoming bridal season and prom and reminiscing with Brandy a little bit. It kind of brings me back. Gosh, it was a long time ago I went to prom, I feel like, but I it was fun. I got stood up. You got stood up for prom? <laughs> oh, no. Yeah. No way. Oh, no. Did you still go? I hope you still went. No. Oh. I went to Princeton Club and just ran the track, like, working <laughs> off my finger. Shucks. Well, at least Maybe you got a workout in. <laughs> right, exactly. See, I was trying to be positive. Yeah, way to get a workout in. Good good for you. It'll be kind of fun to reminisce and hear about some of the fashion trends coming up and brides that are planning yeah. for their spring weddings. This has to be a busy time for Maybe them. I can go Absolutely. find a prom dress and wear it to Frosty Ball. Yes, see, <laughs> it's not too late for you, Kirsten. I'll take you to Frosty Ball, okay, how's that? Okay. <laughs> and speaking of the weddings, we have the Diamond Center coming on. Yeah. Talking about engagement rings and things like that. I have a couple engagement stories that I heard recently. Oh, Did gosh. you guys hear about the guy that bought 99, I don't know why 99, but 99 iPhone 6s, oh. arranged them in a heart shape, and then proposed to his girlfriend in the middle of this, this heart that was on the ground. What was the wow. point of the phone? That sounds uh, so expensive. A, it was. It was. Uh, <laughs> I want to see the ring. <laughs> if that's his budget that's for true. proposal. That's true. That's true. There was no mention of the ring. Apparently, he saved his money for the ring. Right. Yeah. Well, apparently she prefers Android. Oh. She said no. She said no. Oh. <laughs> if he'd only know. And hopefully oh. you can return an iPhone 6. <laughs> oh, probably not. So if not. you see an influx on eBay or something. Right. <laughs> we'll know exactly why. What a strange story. But yeah. hey, you got to get creative these days, right? Right. This next guy was especially creative. Uh, he wanted to, oh, rent a, a crane. Maybe we'll... Uh, have to talk about That'll it. That'll be our teaser. We'll talk yeah. about that <laughs> next time. You'll have to stay tuned. We'll tell you about it later. We Stick are around. Out of time. We'll keep back with more girl talk after this.
Welcome back to Girl Talk. Well, we, we're still in January, but we are looking ahead to spring, which means bridal. Yes. It does. <laughs> and we have your go-to girl. If you're in the market or know someone that's in the market for bridal wear, we have Brandy Niemer from Brandy's Bridal out in New Glarus. Thanks for coming in, Brandy. Hi, thanks for having us again. Glad to have you, <laughs> as yeah. always. Always, always glad, <laughs> yes. So bridal season is in full swing, is that right? Yes, it is. We are ready to go. Um, we hear that 40% of engaged couples out there get engaged between Thanksgiving and Valentine's Day. So typically the first thing they want to do is find their venue and then they shop for their wedding gown because yes. that helps set the trend for their whole wedding. Right. So <laughs> we're in full swing now. Wow. And they've oh had that gosh. gown in their vision for so long. That's the first thing they go to. That's right. right. <laughs> yup. Yup. It is. We were at a bridal show or a couple bridal shows this past weekend and it's all we heard was, I just got engaged and I want to find my dress first. So it's fun for us. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Be, yeah I was just going to say that must be such a cool environment to work in because you it have is. all of these really excited brides and every yes. day must just be pretty fun and it exciting. It is. Every day is different but just making their dreams come true and helping them find what they want and getting to put fashion into it is what makes it worth so it every special. day. Yeah. Absolutely. So Brandy, tell us a little bit about where you're located and what sets Brandy's apart from other bridal shops. Sure. Well, we're located in New Glarus, as you mentioned earlier, and kind of what sets us apart from other bridal store or other bridal salons would be pretty much everything. Um, <laughs> <laughs> we like we like to kind of say that we kind of say we're the unbridal store, um, which means we are still very professional and we do bring in every bridal aspect you're thinking of. But we want people to come in and we want them to just feel totally relaxed and at home and we want you to feel like you are in charge of your own appointment, not just us leading you around and us bringing you gowns. We want you to really feel comfortable. We take you and show you our whole entire store. We let you pick out the dresses you want to try on also. So we really try and make it a fun, a fun event for everybody. Yeah, and it is. Good. Lots of fun. And you have such an incredible selection. Mm, it's, thank you. I understand it's actually the largest selection in the Midwest and yes. you can believe it when you're in there you have it so beautifully organized but there's just tons of choices which is so fun. <laughs> so tell us a little bit about that selection and, and what you sure, have. Sure, sure. Well um, we do have the largest selection in the Midwest. We have over a thousand bridesmaid dresses and over 500 bridal gowns. That's a great. huge selection of mom's gowns, prom, everything. Yes. Um, but with our bridal gowns we started about $2.99 price-wise and can go upwards of there. Um, and then with bridesmaids, we start at $1.29 and go up from there also. And with our selection, um, we do, we travel the whole world actually to bring the best trends at affordable prices to Wisconsin. So we have everything you can think of. Talk so about one-stop shopping. I mean, you can get your whole bridal party yes. yourself. That dream dress you've been looking for is there. You've got the yes. selection. We have everything in every price range. Yeah, <laughs> absolutely. Sounds and low stress while you're shopping? I don't understand. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we really try. Yeah, that sounds great. Um, so you mentioned bridal gowns, bridesmaids, mother of the bride or groom, I, mm -hmm. would, yes. I would presume, yeah. and prom. Prom too. Oh yes, yes, we're getting into the swing of prom right now too. Um, we work with the world's top designers to bring the best and newest fashion trends in prom to Wisconsin also. Um, right now, girls are shopping for prom and prom isn't even until the end of May, but they're all excited <laughs> and you know, the new shapes, the full poofy ball gowns, we have the fun little mermaid fit and flare gowns. Wow. Um, just everything is so bright and colorful now. It's yeah. a lot of fun. So it sounds like there's not even really a trend. A anything no. goes. Anything right, goes. it does. Any Anything goes with prom. And I think every school kind of does something different in every town and things, but it's anything goes with prom. I miss I those years. Yeah. Maybe we all have <laughs> an episode in prom yeah. dresses. There we go. <laughs> For fun. Um, so talk to us about making appointments and do we need them sure. at, Br at Brandy's and just for wedding dresses or prom dresses? Can you come in on a whim? Or? Yeah, yeah. Well, we're open seven days a week, which is great because wow. we are, that includes yeah, Sunday. Um, and yeah. most people don't realize that. Mm -hmm. But with that, um, 
For bridal and bridesmaids, we do suggest appointments um, just because we want to be able to give you that one-on-one -on -one and one-of-a-kind experience. Yeah, so sure. we want to make sure we have a stylist available to help you and a room for you guys to try things on in. Um, but we do also save rooms like on the weekends and such for prom girls and mothers to come in. And they don't ne they don't need appointments. They can just come in, kind of walk around. We do have girls floating around to help answer any questions and things like that. That would be such a great Sunday between a mom and a oh, daughter. Right. Like, hey, let's go out to New Glarus and, mm -hmm. and get a prom dress. Yeah. Even if you're not going to prom or getting married. <laughs> right, yes. <laughs> it's a fun shopping experience. <laughs> oh, and you make it so much fun, too. Oh, Thank thanks. you, Brandy, for Thank coming you. in. Brandy Niemer from Brandy's Bridal out in New Glarus. We'll be back. We're going to keep going with the theme on Valentine's Day with the Diamond Center right after this. Welcome back to Girl Talk. We are filming at the Pink Poodle. But first, we're going to be talking Valentine's Day. We've got Jason Heckendorf. Hello. Thank you. Welcome. Thank you for having me. He's here from the Diamond Center. So we're going to talk about Valentine gift giving ideas. So gentlemen, listen up. Yes. And also my birthday is coming up as well. <laughs> there you go. You go really any reason to buy diamonds is good. Uh, and we're going to be talking about why the Diamond Center is a place for service, selection, price, and warranty. So with Valentine's Day coming up, and if you just a few weeks already, that's crazy. Yeah, I know. Um, what are the hot items for guys or even ladies shopping? What should guys look for? The biggest thing that I start to see is after the holidays, um, you know, it's still a good time to get engaged. So mm -hmm. you, you know, we got engagement rings that start at $149. People can come out. But when it comes down to buying a nice gift, I mean, you can get diamond studs from $69 to $69,000. It's wherever you want to be. Um, for guys, you know, the gals sometimes want to get out and get the guy a piece of jewelry or something mm -hmm. that he can wear. You can get cufflinks. You can get a nice watch. So there's a lot of selection out there, but we really think that this time of year, you know, Valentine's, Cupid's love, mm -hmm. you know, you should get out there and get an engagement ring. For sure, absolutely. Yeah. If you missed it at Christmas, guys, you can... You can <laughs> it's not <laughs> <a> <laughs> your second <laughs> chance, right? <laughs> So Jason, what makes the Diamond Center the place to go for these holiday gifts and engagement rings? I mean, why is it? Why is we, it the Diamond Center? We like to say that we're a jewelry superstore. We offer a little bit of everything, but we really focus on the bridal side of things. Uh, but we have anything from sterling silver jewelry with diamonds to, uh, you know, diamond pendants that are, you know, really large and something that's really sparkly for them. Yeah. We have some even stuff that's not even uh, um, in your base metal so you can get it into a nice price point that you want to be at. So we try to offer you everything but really support it with a great service. Yeah, it sounds like that selection is just really incredible. Yeah, that's mm -hmm. one of my favorite things about the Diamond Center is how big it is. It's so, it, there's so few local jewelry stores that have the selection that you have and the size yes. and being able to shop in a place that has so much selection but still have that family feel sure. I think is just great and uh, you have you've told me about this before and I want you to tell me a little bit more the Diamond Center has a hundred dollar challenge so tell us about that one buying an engagement ring right a hundred dollar challenge is really special to us it's we feel that price and service are very important, but people are out there, they want to know that they have the best price. So we don't believe in a sale. So when it comes to a diamond, we will guarantee to be the best price on any diamond out there by at least $100, or we'll pay you $100. Isn't that cool? Oh, wow. I love that. Yeah. I love Saves that you too. a lot of the legwork too, of, you know? Right. And the stress of trying to go between different yeah, companies and everything. Yeah, just being able to walk into your store and trust that you're getting a, an incredible deal. Yes. yes, and then if you ever find something that's less expensive, mm -hmm. they'll Take care of you. Yeah. Take care Cash. Of you. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Not bad. So on top of getting a great deal, you also offer an unconditional lifetime guarantee, warranty on your yes. diamonds and, and jewelry. How can you offer such an un unbelievable warranty with no catch and no fine print? Well, that's where we think that it's kind of a special thing. You know, a lot of companies out there, you know, they want to they want to try to say they have a warranty, but can they back it up? Do you have to do inspections? With us, it's bar none. If your center diamond falls out, we don't want it to happen, but we're going to cover it. No right. questions asked. There's no inspections. You know, we, we replace 
unfortunately we have to do it every so often a center diamond and they come in they're very surprised to see that oh you're just going to take care of it they don't even realize the warranty that they have when they bought the item so we think it's important to talk about that anything anything that happens to your piece of jewelry we cover it on anything we sell and just knowing that it's such like a stress Right. stressful thing that that can happen you right. know and just having that ease is so great yeah. um, at the Diamond Center do you offer offer appraisals for the jewelry that you sell Yes, everything and comes fully um, fully guaranteed with a report that has a, a lifetime guarantee card as well as it gives you an online vault which gives you your appraisal so all your jewelry is kind of kept in your own little website kind of like your own Facebook page kind of yeah, sort of um, you can keep track of all of it and then you can also see all the service that's ever been done to your ring and you can also digitally send your uh, appraisal to your insurance company I love that oh that's awesome and it's so really easy. quick before we go I want to mention that you guys actually do repairs in store don't you yes we do everything is done in-house um, some designer stuff we'll, we'll ask the designer to help us out with but we have two full-time goldsmiths in our Janesville store in our Madison store sorry and in our Janesville store we have three full-time goldsmiths wow. so everything's done in-house um, you can sometimes get repairs done in up to an hour that's awesome you don't have to send it wow. out it's perfect for lunch. impatient people like me yeah, <laughs> yeah and, and you don't want to send it away either right you know something so expensive so thank you so much Jason Absolutely. for coming on uh, guys and ladies shopping for your gentlemen uh, Valentine's Day just a few weeks away so go to the Diamond Center check it out we're gonna be right back with more girl talk here at the Pink Poodle talking about cleaning out those closets Welcome back to Girl Talk. Now, this is the segment you've been waiting for. It is January, it is cold. We're gonna show you how to warm up for the last few months of January. And we've got owner Beth Testa here at the Pink Poodle. How are you today? We're great. So glad to be here. So, first of all, you look gorgeous, decked out in your furs. And we're gonna talk to you a little bit about fur in just a second. I wanna talk accessories first. So chat with us, if you would, about some of these handbags that are behind us and what's, what's the most important? Well, um, people like labels, that's why they come to the Pink Poodle. We have um, designer sunglasses anywhere from a Maui Gym to a Gucci, we have Chanel, we have Kate Spade. Um, also, you know, the same girls are interested in designer purses, we have Tory Burch, we have Burberry, we have Prada, we have uh, Louboutin, we have Fendi, we also have um, Dior, we have a gorgeous Chanel bag here. That is so beautiful. Love that. Goes with anything you're around. Me feel. Oh, great. I love this Prada bag too in the corner. I want to show that off because this is so cute. It's got its own little you know, a little bit of boxier shape and what a cute scarf that comes with it. And then we also have another Prada bag. Beautiful. Dr. Style with the handle. Dr. Style, yeah, that's big right now. So that's great. So you can get all those accessories at the Pink Poodle for way less than you can get them retail, which is awesome. Uh, but I want to talk, let's move on to the fur. So this is kind of the main event. You look just absolutely stunning. There's nothing warmer than fur. If you are tired of being cold, we have two to three racks of furs, anywhere from jackets, we have mink stoles, we have full length coats. We've sold a ton of furs already this year. The girls just are tired of being cold. Yeah. And we have strollers, which is knee length. And we also have some fur wraps and stoles. So there's a large selection. We also have um, from small to extra large and plus sizes in the fur, so come awesome. in and get your fur. So you can get any length, floor length like Beth has on here, which is just absolutely stunning. 
or this, what do you call this length? This is a stroller. The stroller, length. okay. And, and then we've got the, the shorter as well. So let's talk about some other winter items that you have. Um, we've got some sweaters and, oh, I wanna talk about boots first. I almost forgot, let's talk about boots. We've got a selection of great boots here as well. So tell me what we've got. Um, a distressed look, which is very popular this year with the tall boots. We also have leg warmers, which is in the accessories department again. I'm gonna switch with you and let you get it in there. Um, everybody loves boots. You have to keep your feet warm this year. And the wedges are great for comfort and being in the snow. You know, there's not a lot of... Uh, Boy boot, ankle boots, we have every type of boot you're looking for. They probably start anywhere from $19.99 and go up from there. Awesome. Great selection of shoes. If you've never been to the Pink Poodle for shoes, you have to check it out because they have outstanding selection. Now let's get to this rack too. We've got sweaters, we've got coats galore. So winter is far from over and we have all kinds of things here at the Pink Poodle to shop for you. These guys do a great job. So tell us what you've got on this rack. We're gonna have to kind of move through them quick, but this is great. So have um, winter coats with fur trim. Long coats, short coats, car coats. That one's gorgeous. This is a vintage coat trimmed in curly lamb that just looks Love that. I love those longer, longer lengths in the dressier coats. That's just beautiful. And then we have, I call them the walk the dog coats. There's nothing warmer than a quilted down coat. We have gorgeous sweaters. And again, we have size small to 24. Great. So a huge, huge selection still. There's plenty of winter left as we know. Beth, great job. Thank you so much for pulling a few of these things together. This is just a sample of what they have. This place has so much to offer. We're gonna check out some men's clothes too, so we'll get Joe in here, hang tight. As promised, Joe is joining us, Joe Testa of the Pink Poodle. Thank you so much for giving us some insight into the men's world. Oh, thank you for being here once yeah, again. Yeah, absolutely. Guys, we didn't forget about you. Joe is the men's guru, also owner here at the Pink Poodle. You've got a great selection of men's coats we do. here. Yes, we do. Let's show off some of your favorites. Okay. Talk to me about these. Right here, there's a lot, of, a lot to keep you warm. There's a wonderful North Face jacket, and you can find all styles here. North Face, uh, great brand. Cole Miller bomber jacket, a nice wool jacket of Ralph Lauren, this beautiful Burberry. Look at that Burberry. Coat. Beautiful. Rather pricey because it's Burberry, but then bring it down in, in price and you have a nice Claiborne wool coat with a hood. That's a great jacket for... A beautiful cashmere coat, overcoat. And then in simple sports coat arena, a nice everyday polo sports jacket. These are just samples of finds you'll... you'll discover at the Pink Poodle. And then there's two jackets that I think are just really nice all-round jackets. They go with anything, including jeans. A nice corduroy jacket and a suede jacket. Great selection. And then sweater time. We're still in that sweater weather. It's still cold. Polo, simple hood type uh, sweater. Wonderful Greg Norman zip pullover. And then a simple Joseph Beautiful. Bank cable uh, sweater. Great. All really great finds. All really, if you're looking to to really stretch your budget, it's wonderful. So January is the time when we take a break from consignment. Yes. There's still lots of winter left, so there's lots of great winter clothes here at the Pink Poodle. Absolutely. And then be beginning of February is when we start taking consignment again. So this so is the time to clean out your closet. Is January is the month to start cleaning out your closets and bring start thinking about things that you'd like to bring to the, to the Pink Poodle. Absolutely. And put on consignment beginning of the month of February 1st. Uh, by March, we'll be looking at transitional. And by okay. April, we'll be talking about spring clothing. Perfect. So, yep. so, so start January's cleaning out your closets now, and then you can come in, get these great finds, and bring then some of your Absolutely. things in as well. Absolutely. Excellent. Well, I love the men's section here. Great place to do gifting. Great place to get things for your own closet. Come see Joe. He is the best over here at the Pink Poodle. And Joe, thanks once again for your expertise. Thank you. Appreciate it. Thank you so much for joining us right here at the Pink Poodle. A special thanks to owners Beth and Joe Testa for having us here once again and learning all kinds of great things as we always do. And thanks to our guests. Please join us next time right here on Girl Talk.